So a kid that's in a end of year one of a three year deal, you've got a little bit more time to get him back. If it's he's out of his last year of his contract and he's got to be ready to play next year, he's out of job, you have to take a little more risk. And you discuss that with the athlete, usually in their agent, and you come to this conclusion of, okay, well here's what we got to do, here's what our goal is, and they understand that you know maybe there's a 20% chance this isn't going to work, whereas if we were just treating you like an average person and we could take nine months to get it better, there's a 2% chance it's not going to work. And Usually with patients, we can go through and talk to them about that, and they'll understand the difference, and they'll understand that they don't want to take an extra risk about it. If you're a, a, just a regular person with an injury that you want to get back to playing racquetball in the gym three times a week, you want the 2% failure rate, not the 20% failure rate.